Welcome to First Word Pharma's News Roundup for March 31st, brought to you today by editorial researcher Olivia Roger. In our top news story, the FDA granted full approval to AstraZeneca's Tegriso for the treatment of certain patients with metastatic EGFR T790M mutation-positive non-small cell lung cancer. The oral drug received accelerated clearance from the agency for this indication in 2015 based on tumor response rate and duration of response. Also in the news... GenMap's partner Johnson & Johnson decided against initiating the second stage of a Phase II study investigating Darzelex in three types of relapsed or refractory non-Hodgkin's lymphoma. GenMap explained that the first part of the trial did not reach the predefined futility thresholds of overall response rates. In addition, Merck and Co. and Insight provided further details about their clinical development program combining Keytruda and Epicatastat across five tumor types. The companies noted that there are now seven pivotal studies including trials in melanoma, non-small cell lung cancer, bladder cancer, and renal cell carcinoma. And finally, Johnson & Johnson said that its tender offer for Actelion was successful, with the company controlling 77.2% of the voting rights after the main offer period. Johnson & Johnson noted that it expects the transaction to close in the second quarter. To read these and other stories in full, please visit firstwordpharma.com. Are you able to keep up with all the news and views in the biosimilars market? First Word's Biosimilar Index is the only dedicated biosimilar and non-comparable biologics intelligence tool available. Get ahead of your competition and learn more today. 